or I don't know, but he he's uh, he knows film craft. He's been very involved with film craft. I think uh, any actor who takes his job seriously, anybody who's on a film set and takes his job seriously, would be curious enough to know what is happening elsewhere. You know, why are you lighting in this way? Why are you shooting in this way? Why put, do you want to put the camera there? And then so you learn. You you take all that. You know. Uh, and and yes, he is one actor who's been involved with, with cinema, and not only uh, as an actor, because most actors come and do their jobs and uh, and, and go, uh, not him. You know, 15 years back when everybody was doing 40 films at a time, there was an actor who said, "I'll do one film at a time." You know, 10 years back or whenever, and I think that needs courage. And in this rat race of uh, of bollywood of uh, of numbers and uh, and you know of who's number 1 and number 2 and there was this actor who had enough courage to say okay i'll do one film at a time i'll put my everything into that film i don't think anybody else had had that uh, he's the he's the guy who initiated that everybody else followed you know everybody was playing a, a rough average game okay let me do 20 films uh, 18 of them will be flops two will work you know so okay i'll sustain my career like that. Uh, but this guy said, no, I'll do one film at a time. I'll put my everything into that film. I think that, that speaks of the guy, you know. And I take my hat off to him for that, you know. That you have enough conviction in, in what you're doing. You have enough love for what you're doing, you know. And you're not doing it for other reasons, whether it's fame or money or whatever. You're doing it because you love this job. And I think that paid off, uh, this decision of doing one film at a time, of uh, committing yourself to something, I think that eventually paid off for him. Uh, because the kind of work you will leave behind, it doesn't matter whether you leave 500 films behind or five films, you know. Uh, what matters eventually is uh, how good were your films and how good were you. you know? I think uh, he'll leave behind a, a good body of work. His performance. I'm not a big fan of Lagan, the film, or uh, of Amir's performance. I think the film is, uh, it's been done, that kind of film. It's done in a certain way which is very uh, conventional. It does not break out of the convention. Uh, his performance too, I think it's uh, in the conventional mode. Uh, but again, you know, it's about conviction, you know. Uh, there is a man who said, okay, a film about cricket set in uh, 150 years back in a village who would have taken it you know he took it on you know and, and again he put everything behind that you know, from marketing to 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 shooting in Bhuj to everything you know that uh, I think full marks for courage and conviction you know, full marks